Good morning, everyone. So when it comes to decision making, there are two types of people. There are satisfices and maximizers. A satisficer basically makes the decision once their basic criteria are met. It doesn't mean they settle for mediocrity or they have low standards. They could have high standards, but once those criteria are met, they make a decision. A maximizer, on the other hand, has to shop around and make the best, most optimal decision. So um, we're all, we, we, we are all a mixture of both when it comes to decision making. We approach some decisions with a satisfying approach and some decisions with a maximizing approach. But the interesting research is that maximizers often report high levels of stress and anxiety when they have to make a decision. So what is the takeaway? I'm trying to tell you, remember, economics is the science of making choices. It's the science of making decisions. Not every decision has to be a maximizing decision, all right? Try and take more of a satisfying approach um, towards decisions that you have often approached with a maximizing approach. And you'll notice you will feel less anxiety and less stress. You know, going out for grocery shopping, for example, a lot of people, I'm all about finding good deals, but a lot of people stress a lot about finding good prices at grocery stores. And we live in an age where we are inundated with choice. So maybe grocery shopping, um, taking more of a satisfying approach can be less stressful and less anxiety inducing. Now, some decisions I would say definitely take a maximizing approach. You know, the decision to get married, yeah, that's not a decision you should take lightly. The decision to pack up and move overseas, especially if you're going to have to uproot your children or your family. So I would definitely take, say, strike a balance between when to make, um, when to take a satisfying approach and when to take a maximizing approach. And you'll notice you'll feel less stress and less anxiety. Have a good one.